Good morning, everyone. It's the 2nd of October 2020, and we're looking at Mesoblast or Mesoblast. And the announcement came out today. Basically, not crash hot. And uh, it's tanking really hard. So we got a match price of 361, and it's currently 947. So if you're watching this, you can fast forward about 10 15 minutes, and uh, you can watch the open from there. Otherwise, just going to be discussing or looking at charts. Someone in Discord with me is also trading the open for this one. So really the consensus is that it's going to be a buy on open effectively, or at least a few pips below. Um, when it opens, it might dip maybe 10 cents and then rally to the upside. That's sort of the expectation at this point depending on how hard it gaps down the harder it gaps down the more likely it will shoot to the upside so we've got horizontal here that's a nice horizontal at just above three dollars we got this trend line as well at around 370 375 so you know if it bounces if it opens around let's say 310 it could drop down to three dollars Rally up to 370, 360, and then be a short from there. But really, it purely depends on the match price here, what it opens at. So for MSB, uh, it can open at 10.04 and 15 seconds at the earliest, and 10.04.45 at the latest. So when it hits 10.04, uh, 10014, you'll probably see all the fake orders get pulled if there are any. MSB MSB typically doesn't have fake orders, I noticed. That's that's the one thing I noticed when we were trading it last time during that big dip where it dropped it down to three dollars. That spoof orders weren't really a thing. You talking to me? Yeah. Um I'm back. What you, what were you saying? I was saying the spoof orders on MSB didn't really exist last time because the volumes were so strong i think they just I think they're yeah. afraid to put in spoof orders i don't even know yeah. well you get run over potentially if you but right. i'm assuming those spoofs are algos yeah but they're designed not to get hit exactly but yeah exactly. that's just the one thing i remember quite specifically about the last time i dropped was that i did not see spoofs at all everything that was there was getting hit Yeah, it's going to, I think it's going to move fast for the first 15. It's going to be up. Everyone's going to be focused on it. I think it'll actually take some of the shine off Zip's massive run yesterday as well. There's not much by way of trend lines on this one. Nah, because it's just so gappy, it's all over the shop. Nothing's established. Are you currently recording? Yeah. Yeah, 10 minutes before. It opens, it's probably a little bit too long, but I'm trying to I'll work out some trend lines and maybe some FIP levels. Uh, where are you drawing your FIBs from? Uh, I'm going to see what happened last time. Just yeah. how much it pulled back. Yep. Morning, Jungle. Welcome back. Oof. <laughs> Your vibrator's going off, mate. <laughs> okay, so when it opened last time, uh, because it, I think it dipped like 10 cents, it pulled back to 38.2, roughly. Yeah, I, I don't think it pops on the match. I think it has a little sell down from those those P 
panic people and then heads up and then yeah as old mate said sells off for the rest of the day possibly down to three dollars hmm let me bring up historical ms speech god i hope it performs like it did on the 11th of august that would be so nice that was also a friday This is the half hour chart of MSB. Uh, so it opened at the wrong candles. Um, what's the exact time that uh, M opens, by the way? I really need to write that down on a uh, post-it note. Yeah, I got it on a post-it note. 10.04.15 to 10.04.45. 10.04, okay, yeah, I'm gonna go write it all down now. So it was almost a 50% pullback. Yeah, so from when it opened, 386 to 380, so it dropped six pips. Uh, rallied. Okay. Rallied almost 50 pips. 50 yeah, that's a, yeah, that's a big pop from 80, 82 up to roughly 32, 31. I think it's worth, if you do take a position at the top, or just before it dumps, um, it's worth, you know, uh, holding you know, most of that position for the majority of the day. Morning, gents. Hello, mate. Morning, change. Just recording, by the way. <laughs> you can talk. I get you. Did you end up um holding zip overnight, change? That's my friend. You did. Yes. Yeah, same. I, I, I have. It lost 30. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think it's going to bounce somewhere. <laughs> One way to the upside. <laughs> it's definitely going to go up or down, mate. <laughs> I, just think, I just think that gap is, is possibly overdone. Yeah, just watch the um, surplus volume right on the open, man. All right, short fills are available. Yes, so it does the first thing I checked this morning. <laughs> Forgot. <laughs> I locked some in, but it's way way above market. I saw that. See myself shorting this on open. Wait, what do you mean lock locked them in? So you can put it, have it guaranteed. Nice. Put the order in now, oh. so it's so he gets the shorts. Yes. Oh, that's a really good idea, and just amend it later. Yeah, that's right. Ah, I never even thought of that. Yeah. Straight up rookie. <laughs> I'm going to go through the actual announcement. I don't know what they're saying. Obviously, it's bad, but... Last time, it was go and do a bit more work, and then the next day it was, yeah, yeah, we've done the more work, and they're happy with what we've done, and it had a hundred and eighty point swing in two days. Did anyone actually go through the announcement for Miso Blast? No. Oh, yeah, actually, yeah. Um, they just said, look. Uh, even though nine out of ten, oh, um, nine to one, yeah, nine to one, yeah, voted in favour. Somebody I, I can't remember the name still wants to another another phase of testing on on um, adults and children. So it's it's not a definitive no. It's just 
We yeah. just want a little more information. Apparently no approved treatments for this life-threatening condition. I don't, I don't see this as a terrible announcement. Then it's, again, it's not a 37% dumb announcement in my opinion. Hmm. What did you have your um, short set to change? Oh, it's way above, bud. Uh, six six twenty or something. Yeah. What? How can you have it further than eight percent from the match? That's that's what I'm. The time I put it in, it wasn't further than eight percent. Ah, okay, um... gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, it's three eleven. What a monster of a sell-off. And I'd be rich if this had uh, derivatives. I would have piled in on what's downside so much bigger than the uh, upside. I was thinking, like, let's say this was approved and everything went swimmingly. Well, what's it go? Like 5% up? Wait, it, if, it, if it was good? Yeah. I think it, I think it goes, I go, I think it goes this percent in the other direction, to be honest with you. Back in a sec. some parabolic yeah i got i got smashed in um well not smashed but i, I got done a little bit in um zip yesterday when i went parabolic i've tried to fade it on the front side and then it went again what were you, what were you trading yesterday change uh, in the morning, mainly just zip yesterday, actually, but I had to um, do a few things and so I wasn't um, as um... active. Yeah, yep. that's the right word. Finished to my monthly report and some stuff like that. Yeah, I'm going to do mine tomorrow morning. Hey, did you read um, uh, Chase's monthly report? Yeah. God, he does a good report. Yeah, he really gets in depth with it, which is good. I want to take his. I actually was thinking I need to take his um, template. Yeah, I'm probably going to do the same. Just the stuff that he's thinking about. I, he's on a, a different level to me. That's for sure. Yeah. Okay, look. In reverse for the rest of the day, I think. Oh fuck, we're open. Mhm. Mm Why is ASM not open? Oh, it is. Held an overnight, overnight long for uh, A2 milk. Got a few pips out of it. Four minutes, less than four minutes for MSB. ARR got smacked on open. I almost want to go long bang on the match. Three dollars bang on support too. Yeah. It's gonna be hard not to go long there. Two nine nine. I usually don't touch the match, but I think I might for this one. 
two ninety. Jesus. Ten oh four, you reckon? Ten oh four ten oh four fifteen. Yep. Plus or minus. No, ten oh four fifteen plus thirty seconds. Oh, is that because of the announcement? I know, I know the no, no, it's 10.04.15 to 10.04.45. Oh, I thought it was 10.04.30 plus or minus 15 seconds. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It was 10.04.15 plus 30 seconds. Same thing. Oh, okay. Sorry, yeah. bud. 285. Wow. I want the spark clock to remain with the seconds on it. Yeah, right. One minute. At the very least, a rally to three dollars. It opens below it. Okay, so it's building from two eighty to two ninety. Still got negative volume. 15 seconds. Still negative 18. Okay. Okay, should be live any second. Yep. Put in a match for 300. Okay. Long. Negative 19. Negative 9 uh, mil. Jesus. I got it on match. Yeah, I went long. Go to my long at two nine five. I'm gonna add if it cracks three oh four. Two ninety is a strong level as well. Yeah. Shorting. Sold into that two ninety and went short.
struggling to sell down though. Yeah. 285. Yeah, I went long again. I had to. <laughs> yeah, so. Once that 290 broke to the downside, I had to continue and I just didn't. Got chopped up on open, but you can break even once it cracks 304, 305. Yeah, so it's done the same thing as last time, except instead of 10 pips down, it's, what, 20 pips? Something like that, yeah. There we go. Added to the long, like everyone else would be. Adding again. Where's the first level of resistance? I oh, did it all the way up at like <laughs> three sixty. But it's still too early, like the it's, it's not it's still in the first fifteen minutes, so it can swing either way still. Yeah. Is it back and strong? Yeah. I took profits just now. Closing out here. Look at this candle develop. Weak as shit. Got out at 3.18. Would be a bit premature. But the uh, sell pressure came in pretty hard. A bit of reloads too. Uh, getting a first short at 3.16. Just a small size. Yeah, watch if this one breaks 312. It'd be a bit of a downswing, probably to a, maybe 309 at least. I want this one to go green. Ah, let's add on more. <clears throat> Beautiful. That was, if anyone were watching this on YouTube for the replay, watch how that can, that last candle developed. Look at the candle, not the order book. It was beautiful. Adding short 307, probably a bit, a bit early. VWAP's around 300 so far. Need, need this candle to stay below 312.
few up to three dollars. Yeah, true. Would be a nice target. Beautiful. I'm looking for three oh one. Close out the short. Three oh two, come on. Going long here at 311. Not happy. Missed it by a couple of pips. No, sorry, I missed it by one pip. It hit 302. Son of a bitch. No, this should be another swing to the upside, hopefully. Nice little swing up. It was basically right next to VWAP at 300. Didn't quite get there, but what you gonna do? Pretty much bouncing off the $3 level, effectively. Here we go, that 315 was the level. And boop. Us. Added a little bit more at 316. Does it, does it break 324? Uh, this 320 is the order book resistance. I don't think that really matters too much. Getting close to that 15 minutes. Yeah, I sold a third of my position at 320. Yeah, I just sold half just in case it looks struggling. Yeah, I closed out here at three. Yeah, closed it out. And look, if it rallies and it pops, I'll just get back in. But... The volume's increased from the last 
the three minute anyway. So I'm gonna the hold. Three, I think it cracks. Three twenty just keeps really. No, cracked. Cracked. Is it new high of the day? No, three twenty four really? is. Been rejected off it. A little bit. Just a little bit. Uh, doing a small short at 321. Oh. Just a, just a small one. And I'll add on if it gets completely rejected. I want to see like a bearish engulfing to really, really pile in on that short. I just sold another third here, keeping one third. 320 looks strong now. Yeah. Going long. 323, three, close out my short. Don't look at zip riffles. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> It's 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 the chart next to Mezzo, so I can see. It. <laughs> <It's like. laughs> took a took a half size two pip hit and reversed it. I just added Easy. a third here. Easy long. That three twenty stack really helped when it came down to it, and just yeah, didn't stand a chance short. Beautiful. I'm looking to add on pullback. Yeah. Pullback? Best of luck seeing one of those. Yeah, he's... Yeah. I still got my core long from the open. Nice. Gonna be looking for a struggle handle development. But I really should just let this go and just ride them in. Yeah, I think that trend line we drew in could be the could be the bounce point, or at least pullback point. The question is, does it end up red for the day, as in below open price? Yeah. I'll probably take some off at 350, as long as it breaks 340. Closing out at 3.41, let's go. Too soon, too soon. <laughs> too soon, man. Close out all the position at 3.40. Look at this candle struggle. Oh, oh, oh. Going here at 3.43, I'm gonna close it out real soon. If it I'm not going to take more than two pips, three pips here, I don't think, for a loss. If three, four, five cracks, no, I'm I out. still think there's, there's too much Momo upside. Yep, no, I'm out. I feel kind of stupid doing this going long at 352, but I guess right. I took a little bit of third off. And feels late. It was like a firm mode in on that. Yeah, I'm, I'm out for now. I'll get back in on the pullback. Going short. Yeah, me too. That was just a terrible entry. Silly boy. Yeah, my initial short was correct. All right. Pretty much recovered everything in this prop. <laughs>
I don't see anything on the daily. I think that was just an intraday from uh, open to about 10. Just basically the top side trend line is where it got rejected off. So I think it's just going to be a little bit of a pullback. Be crazy. I'm looking for it to pull back to uh, 325. Reason? Um, the previous high. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. VWAP's down to 311. Not sure it gets anywhere near there, but. Yeah. Oh, what a nice drop. Okay, I'm in this, long. This is why my stops are so tight. If I get it wrong, a couple Small of pips position. just close it out. Worst case, I can reopen. It goes my way. So, got stopped out here, went short, went long. Both times, really tight stops. And now I'm riding a much bigger momentum swing to the downside. And same thing here. Um, there was a short, where was it? 320, 324, 323. It took two pips. And I just closed out my long. Sorry, my short. Nice level, Riffles. Thank you, mate. Hopefully it holds. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, good. 325 is good. Let's hope it's not a change of trend. It's just a pullback. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'd agree. Three twenty five was a trend line as well, so nice and strong. Horizontal and trend line. Oh, beautiful. Going long at three thirty. A little bit soon. Looking for the long at three twenty six. Why is it coming back to VWAP? Closed it out and went short. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to be re react to this price action. Yeah, to be like maybe three eleven. Let's go. Or is it three three twelve now? Mm. Close it out at three thirteen. I think it's there. And if it goes through that, then it's probably just a downswing for an hour or so. Reload buyer at three twenty. Piling on the short. Give me three twelve. Come on. I'm gonna put a little long here with a stop below VWAP and then I'm probably just gonna go and have some morning tea. And just relax. Up back. Again, missed the VWAP by a goddamn pip. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Yeah, I wanted to a bit, of, a bit of continuation would be nice. Oh, 
still got my shorts on from the 320 range. 322, 323, 21, 319. Yeah, got it everywhere. Looks like the selling has slowed a bit. Mm. Just looking at the orders, the sells just don't quite have as much girth to them. <laughs> you like that word? Uh, <laughs> I'll wait for it to crack 320. 330? No, no, no. To close out my yarn, uh, to close out my short. Closing that. I want to go long in. Bad idea. Should have went long as I closed out my short. Hindsight. And I think that's it for morning volume and volatility. I think the rest is going to be a bit of a grind. Yeah, I got out of my my long just now. Don't know what it's going to do. And that's it for the morning session. Oh, very that's exciting. Very good day, as always with Catalyst. You make a good shot. Very good shot. Good man. Yeah, That's what I was waiting for. It's a weak bounce off VWAP and then a smash right to it. Yeah, my my pen looks a bit a bit more tasty today because I accidentally went way too big on that open drive. The long, <laughs> incidentally, because you add an extra zero to your volume. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it worked in my favor. I'm up two eighty four in comparison to like twelve bucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is looking a bit nicer. Put in shorts here. Ready? Ooh. Like a maybe three pip stop on this. Okay, good. That to me, that's yeah, go on and up. And that's all, folks.